Yes, the problem prince, Prince Andrew, never the king's favorite uh, brother and a constant stone in his slip-on shoe. The problem now arises because uh, Prince Andrew, who has not been a working royal uh, and has given up the use of the uh, honorific title HRH, uh, wishes to have his uh, personal protection reinstated. Well, that costs us, the taxpayer, around three million pounds a year. Now, the glorious white wedding cake of a wonderful house he lives in, Royal Lodge at Windsor, that is protected because it's a, a royal residence. But when he goes out, he doesn't have detectives around him and he wants them back. And there's been a very unwise uh, intervention by the former Home Secretary, Priti Patel, writing to the wrong person, the, Queen, the King's private secretary, asking uh, that this should be considered. Um, it won't be because uh, we have to save money somewhere. And uh, that goes with the territory. If you're not a working member of the royal family, you do not have the personal protection. So it's another problem, but it will be parked and uh, Prince Andrew will not get his own way. I can say that for sure. The other question which you raised quite rightly is the fact that Prince Harry, another problem prince, is coming back to our shores on the, uh, on the 7th, the day before the first anniversary, sad anniversary of uh, Her Majesty the Queen's death last year. He's coming back for an award ceremony, a well child. It's something he's been involved with for many years. In fact, it predates um, uh, Meghan Markle. He's coming. She will not be with him. And we're told that he's not going to be meeting any members of the royal family. Isn't that a big surprise? And then he'll be going on to the Invictus Games, which this year are taking place in Dusseldorf on beside the Rhine, sponsored by the German army. Now, that's a brilliant initiative. That's something he did well before he met Michael. Meghan. It's the Michael, sort of thing he should be doing, Esther. Meghan, Meghan's not wearing her wedding ring, or there were pictures without that on. Is this now Harry trying to get back into the royal fold, maybe figuring out where he goes next if Meghan's off elsewhere? Uh, Esther, you and I both know uh, that the prodigal son is always welcome. It's in the Bible. It's one of the parables. Uh, and of course, he would always be welcome back, but there would have to be a lot of abject apology and explanation because uh, Prince Harry did something that was unforgivable to his brother. He criticized uh, Catherine uh, and also he criticized the Queen, Camilla, in his book and in the television programs, which you all remember with great relish, of course, or, or disdain, depending upon your taste. And most men, I think Philip will agree with me, can put up with being insulted. My goodness, I've been insulted by experts over the years. But what they don't like, men, is having their wives uh, insulted, and they were insulted. That, and also having your driving ability uh, questioned by anybody, those are the things men cannot stand. They can put up with most other things. So there would have to be a lot of fence mending before he would ever be readmitted to the royal fold. Michael Cole, thank you very much.